hello guys welcome to my youtube channel how are you guys doing today hope everybody is fine uh if this is the first time you're tuning into my channel please watch the video if you find it interesting you can like and then subscribe subscribe is free you just click the subscribe button and then click the notification bell above so that whenever i drop any video you'll be notified so today i want to talk about this guy a ghanian his name is goshas yeah like on social media all social media platform when you search goshas you will see this guy he's a great guy he's a pan-african he's someone that loves africa so much he's not that type of person that will, that will, that that maybe because when i was in ghana some people say charlie what you do what you do for ghana that question sometimes is <laughs> I, I, I used to pretend them to just like answer it but like somehow you're asking a fellow african what he's doing in your country yeah that, that question was asked to me when i was in ghana but then i respectfully told the person that i was on holiday i don't live in ghana you understand it's a beautiful country i would even love to live there but i know i don't live there i live in in my country but i love ghana so much ghana is beautiful so back to this guy this great guy gracious that's his name like on all social media platforms so this guy is currently in nigeria he's driving around nigeria he's driving around the giant of africa and guess what i'll post some of the things he, he, he said about nigeria i'll post them here on this you see them in this video this guy praised nigeria is like nigeria is beautiful this when he gets when he got to lagos state he was like wow this place is beautiful when he got to Calabar, he even described Calabar as being more beautiful than Switzerland. Maybe not as beautiful as Switzerland, but you know, beauty is in the eyes of the of the beholder. Besides, a country being beautiful, a country is, de is, is it develops according to its own culture, its own topography. Take for instance South Africa. South Africa has its own type of topography that, that gives its country a type of beauty. You understand? Then if you come to Nigeria too, we have our own type of beauty that makes our country unique. Every country has their own unique beauty. Some countries, you know, you see rocks, rocks. Some countries you see beaches like around something, something unique. So Goshas is driving his high powered power bike motorcycle, power bike. He drove all the way from Ghana to Nigeria, passing Togo. Then the republic and then coming into nigeria when this guy came into nigeria he was saying positive things about nigeria like that nigeria is beautiful nigeria is very fine and it's true most ghanians don't believe that nigeria is beautiful but the ghanians that come to nigeria they are always shocked when they come to nigeria what they see they don't expect it because what the media says or how the media portrays nigeria to them they think nigeria is a sort of a place you that they don't have fine buildings fine houses or even the good roads you know we might not have good roads everywhere which is not just nigeria it's even in ghana too but when they come to nigeria they are they are shocked so goshas is in nigeria currently now goshas is in calabar he described calabar as being as beautiful as switzerland beauty is in the eyes of the beholder maybe not not to you it might not be beautiful like switzerland but of like he, that this, this description is like trying to tell you how beautiful calabar is to him so this guy is driving all over nigeria and not just Nigeria, he's going to drive all over Africa. He started this thing March 16th. And he says he's going to stop uh, December 16th. 10 months, Charlie. You know, be easy. This Ghanaian guy is a Pan African, someone who loves Africa so much, someone who has Africa at heart. You understand? So he's an advocate of, you know, Africa going borderless and visaless. Let me explain what he means by africa going borderless and visaless like he wants this border if this country has this border this country has this border you know he wants these things to, to to stop to change he wants freedom of movement for africans in africa freedom of movement and goods this is going to help the economy of africa this same guy talked about africa having one single currency one single currency just like the French speaking Africans, they use one currency. He wants Africa to have one currency. This is going to help Africans a lot. Now, talking about the visa, 
you would notice that you as an African, maybe from West Africa, you're going to another region of Africa, it's difficult for you to even get into that country, that African country, because they will ask you for a visa, like you, you have some visa requirements. Like it's difficult for you as an African to travel to other parts of Africa. Whereas in Europe, once you have the European passport, Europeans freely travel. They don't go to, through the stress we here in Africa go through while traveling. The Europeans travel freely. Somebody can drive from Luxembourg to Belgium, from Belgium to here and there and there, like without stress. That's how it is in Europe, in the European Union. Or well, here in Africa, they make things difficult for us. Like it's difficult for you to travel from here to here. You keep on, you know, restrictions, pay this, pay that, to do this, to do that. Whereas we are all one people, we are Africa. So yeah, Doshas, like I said, he's a great guy. He's a Pan-African. And he's going to travel to the 50-something countries that make up Africa. And he's going to show you the beauty of Africa. So you can subscribe to his YouTube channel, his Goshas, his Facebook, Goshas. Hey, Charlie, when this guy got to Uwere in the eastern part of Nigeria, he, he took a picture in the iconic church there, Azonta Cathedral. And he, he, he said, this city is very beautiful. You can imagine a Ghanaian saying that this city is beautiful. Now, it's not just about the Ghanaians. When other foreigners come to Nigeria, people from Germany, Poland, they visit Nigeria, they enjoy and they have fun. Nigeria has a lot of beautiful states, cities, beautiful cities like Port Harcourt, Lagos, the Calabar he went to, Apaibon, different beautiful places. You understand? So we are Africans. We need to be traveling without restrictions within Africa. And kudos to those countries that have lifted, you know, like made traveling to their country easy. I think Kenya or Visa, they, uh, they, they removed visa requirements like for Nigeria, right? Uh, it's no longer as di difficult as, as it is to be before to go to Kenya as a Nigerian. Now, I think you just do your online application and all that and you, you travel. So, yes, the purpose why I'm making the, this video aside the borderless Africa is the beauty of Nigeria. Nigeria is a beautiful country. Now, when you, some people, some Ghanians in Ghana, they don't like, they say, oh, Nigeria, I call it what they see on the media. I saw people saying on his comment section, guys, guy, be careful so that you not be kiddy and be mapped. But well, these guys been traveling, you know, across states in Nigeria since and without stress. And guess what? In his Facebook page, he's also talking about how Nigerians are being helpful. Like he has never seen this type of people before. Nigerians are showing him like, support nigerians are helping him where he needs their help they are willingly there to help him like yesterday when he was in calabar he the, all the hotels were booked of course it's weekend and weekends in some cities in nigeria it's difficult for you to get a, a free hotel because weekends people just go there to lodge and relax so it was the nigerians that received him when he got to calabar that he slept over in their house this guy has visited so many beautiful places in nigeria in the western part of Nigeria, has gone to the rocks, has gone to the palace of great kings and all that. This guy cannot stop talking about Nigeria and how beautiful Nigeria is. So you can check him out on Facebook and YouTube, Goshas. Thank you guys for watching this video. Africa is blessed. Africa is beautiful. Please don't forget to like, don't forget to subscribe, and do not forget to share this video. See you guys in the next video. Bye.